Welcome back to Crystal Clear on the Roundtable, the show on the internet that talks about all things Steven Universe. I'm your host, Ostrich Vox, and with the revelation that Rose was Pink Diamond, thus making Steven Pink Diamond, or at least in possession of her gemstone, what's going to happen with his fusions? Now, fusion has always been a very important aspect of Steven Universe, and are the physical manifestation of a relationship. Whether that be romantic, platonic, sibling-like, all fusions hold great significance. They mean something. And with something as life-changing as finding out your mother was actually a diamond? We could see this impact Steven in many different ways, and I think his fusions could be one of them. Now, we previously theorized Steven's gemstone could turn back into the place of pink diamonds. You know, the little cool upside down shape. I think it would be interesting to see Steven embrace the title of Steven Diamond Universe as opposed to Steven Quartz Universe. And the next time Steven runs into the diamonds, he's going to have to prove he has her gemstone somehow, assuming he tells them the truth. But you could also make the argument, well, pink diamond did cease to be. Rose Rose Quartz is what Pink Diamond became. That's why a fusion like Rainbow Quartz was Rainbow Quartz, not Rainbow Diamond. Why Rose's gemstone conveniently stayed into place when fused with Pearl and didn't revert back to its diamond formation. So if Steven embraces his mother for who she really was and accept that she decided to live and die as Rose Quartz, then by extension, everything revolving his powers, his fusions would remain the same. But that feels like kind of a cop out. And while Steven can still accept his mother for who she really was and embrace that she she was, at the end of the day, Rose Quartz. That doesn't mean he has to identify as a Rose Quartz, but can still go by the title of a diamond. Just a very short, fleshy, pudgy diamond. Yeah, yeah, it's weird. The point is, in the case that Steven embraces being a diamond, staying true to his roots, and becomes fully dedicated to righting his mother's wrongs, then by proxy, his fusions would be affected as well, such as the likes of Smoky Quartz. The next time Steven and this fuse, the fusion may not be Smoky Quartz, but they may identify as Smoky Diamond, which is a genuine real life thing. I don't believe this fusion would alter much besides their change in name and Steven's gem formation. But since fusions are the amalgamation of their composing gems, I feel like it would stand to reason Smoky Quartz would get some kind of boost in power. Because remember, Steven's powers aren't tied to his emotions. Being a diamond is definitely going to have some kind of emotional impact, and it could be for the better. It could allow him to tap into powers he never knew before, powers that could be implemented and boosted in a fusion. Although we haven't seen Pink Diamond do much in her proper form, besides crushing up dirt and turning them into gem shards. Yeah, that was something. But we're clearly going to get more flashbacks, so maybe we can see Pink Diamond in action, utilizing some of her more unseen, greater abilities. Also, in hindsight, Smokey Quartz's hair did match up with Pink Diamond's quite a bit. There is a strong similarity between the two. It's just a tad messier. And considering Pink Diamond's hair does strongly resemble Steven's, this does does make perfect sense. And who knows, Rebecca Sugar did tease Rainbow Quartz 2.0, but maybe that title itself was a misdirect. Will we get like a Rainbow Quartz ever again, or will we get another version? Like, is there any plan for that? Um, well, I don't want to give any spoilers, but uh, Rainbow Quartz 2.0 would invariably be different. Uh, uh, well, maybe that. I said that. Up until that moment of letting it slip out, Rebecca Sugar tried to carefully phrase her words, so Rainbow Quartz 2.0 could have been one of those careful phrases, but was still considered a spoiler in her eyes. She hinted that because Steven is, well, Steven, Rainbow Quartz 2.0 would be inherently different. But Rainbow Quartz 2.0 could also be different because it won't be Rainbow Quartz at all, but Rainbow Diamond, which could be all sorts of fun and emotional. I mean, Pearl's naturally emotional, Steven's naturally emotional, the show is naturally emotional, the idea of them fusing just makes me near, I, I don't even And then there's Stevani. Now, I don't think Stevani would change too much, if at all. I mean, the three-fourths human, one-fourth gem. So again, while the gem formation would change, Stevani would probably be the least affected by this. Although, I don't know. Give her pink diamond eyes. Seriously, I really want to see that in the show. Overall, these fusions could, and I believe, should change. It's tiny little details that would spice up the show and reflect how far Steven is maturing. After all, you need love to grow. I don't know how that relates to all this, but it's Steven Universe. It'll work somehow. What do you guys think? Would you want to see Steven's fusions updated to reflect his diamond status? Let us know in the comments below or tweet those Ostrich to me at Ostrich Vox or at the Roundtable on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram all at Roundtable Vids. Help the Roundtable grow by subscribing to us on Patreon. Get access to exclusive perks and have your name featured at the end of the video like all these beautiful, wonderful people. Link in the description. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, share, and if you're new here, subscribe. Hit that bell for notifications to never miss a Steven Universe theory. I'll Hope you have a wonderful day and Ostrich Fox out. Bye bye.